Opening BOF first thing in the morning, I get an immediate overview of what is seriously happening in fashion on that moment. The beauty of what uh, BOF is doing is that it's private and intimate, and that's when people share more than they would in a bigger environment. It never ceases to amaze me how talented, smart, and engaged our community is at the Business of Fashion. And our goal is always to bring that community together uh, and to engage in conversations like these. Business of Fashion is kind of the leading resource on factual information about the fashion industry. As a consultant, subscribing to Business of Fashion is extremely valuable to just stay on top of where the industry is at. I love VOM, I'm a huge fan. They do a fantastic job, they bring intelligence to the voice around the industry. And what I love is that it focuses on the business. What I love about the newsletters is they're always the first ones to break the really big news. When they break the big news, they've got all the facts, they've got all the quotes, they've got it from every angle. So really it's the only place you need to go. I read Business of Fashion every day. It's really is the one source that I look to. I think it was great that Tim and Imran were here. Um, I think it was great that they recognised Australia, Sydney especially, um, as a city to bring all of these people together and, and start a conversation. I'd have to say the highlight today was the fact that no one wanted to leave the room. The engagement and, and that sort of collective energy is just inspiring. This is just the beginning. 